Hello and welcome to another video. Sorry I haven't been uploading videos lately but it's uh, difficult with the kids off and doing their homeschooling. I'm a uh, unpaid teacher by day now and uh, full-time tech support in the evening and weekends so it doesn't leave a lot of free time. But I ordered this. Now I've already unboxed one of these uh, in an earlier video but they're really hard to find in a good condition and when I saw this one on eBay in a good condition at a decent price I thought I'd better snap it up. Uh, good packing, that's what I like to see, let's get rid of that. I'll just move the camera in a bit further. That's, that's a bit odd. It's in a sealed UPS bag inside a cardboard box. Okay, so the box is a bit tassy, but this is the original box for another uh, Panasonic SJ uh, MJ50 mini display. It's not complete, unfortunately, but, that's, but it was in good condition, so that's what I really wanted it for. And let's have a look. It's clearly being used because it's a bit dusty, but it's nice to have another charger. And here's the speakers for it. I think they've been dented, they're a bit. Uh, it's like something's been pushed down on there. These are my original ones. And they're not dented very much. Still, they're in good condition. There's no, no scratches I can see here. There's a little dent now in the grill. But that opens out and the player slides inside it. So I keep meaning to do a video on this player with explaining all the features but I just haven't got around to it. So there's the player itself. So let's have a look at that. Unfortunately the light conditions aren't great because it's really the dead of night at the moment and there's I can see on the screen on my phone that I'm recording this on there's a bit of flicker so there's a tiny little scratch there. Or is that just grease? I reckon that might just be grease. There, Mr. Sheen. Elliot would be proud. I missed. <laughs> yeah, it is a tiny little scratch there. I don't know whether you can see it. It's really hard for the camera to focus because it's silver. Yeah, excellent. So that's in very good condition. Now these in you know, these, especially the speakers, when they're not scratched, are very very hard to find uh, and at a decent price. And I use this player quite a lot. So let's put my demo disc in. And you did say that it's hard to get the disc out. Oh, it's hard to get the disc in as well. This is the lever to get the disc out. Yeah, and it's getting stuck in there. Mine is hard to get out as well. My, my first one. Yeah, this one doesn't want to come out at all, does it? Let's compare that with my one. Yeah, that pops out. But it's still hard to pull out here. There's some sort of problem with the mechanism on here, but you can actually put the disc straight in through that Perspex bar there. So it's sticky now, it's trying to get out. Anyway, let's make sure it's working. Probably going to be much, it's going to work much better if I put a battery in. So let's have a look at those battery contacts. 
Ancora. Excellent, so that's working nicely. Brilliant, so one thing I didn't have, so this is the remote for it, which I had on the original player that I did the original video on. And the one thing I didn't have, not that I would ever use one, is the uh, battery adapter. Let's turn the speaker off. So that attaches here, and it's different from the Sony ones. So that attaches there, and that's in good nick as well. So pleased with that. Nice little addition. Snap them up. There's a little scratch there, I think. Snap them up if you see them in this good condition, because they're quite rare. So let's find my... That's the new speaker, I think. Hard to tell which is the new one. Oh, that's the new one. The new one's in my right hand. That's the one I already had. And you can see, you can probably make out there's a little dent there on this new one. I'm not worried about that, but I do keep it in this because when I want to charge it, I can attach the charger to the charging port there. And then when I finish with the player, I can just slot it in there and it will charge. If I wanted to, I could play it from here. Okay, so I'm going to give you a demonstration of the speaker system here. Um, the player just slots into there. And as I said, that will charge just like that. But if you want the um, sound to come out of these speakers, there's a slider there. And that slider slides across the headphone jack, which goes into the headphone socket there. So we slide that in, push that across, and then on here we can um, slide that down to use the remote control for the controls. We can slide it up to use these. And you can put it on charge there as well. And you can add the battery adapter to here as well. So you've got a truly portable battery powered system. I just love the look of these things. So I'm really pleased to get a player which is almost unscratched. Speakers have been pushed down. Probably they've been dented by someone doing that to get the player in and out. But yeah, very pleased with that. All right, so one thing I forgot to do is give you a good look at the box. So uh, thanks for watching. Don't expect too many videos because it's really hard for me to find time to to shoot them and edit them. Um, now I've taken on the uh, homeschooling role with my kids. So hopefully you'll stay safe and I'll see you in another video soon. Thanks.